All right, so let's look at the bonuses that are being dished out this week in Grand Theft Auto 5. Now, what I'm just completing right now would be the last mission over here for the first dose, which this week is dishing out times and a half on hard mode. So after about a half an hour of playing the game, because I'm doing this completely by myself and dying a few times, here we go, you guys, times and a half with the first dose missions. How much money do you think that we're going to be able to get right now? Well, we're about to check this out and see if it's actually worth doing. All right, so once again, it took me about 30 minutes to complete this mission, and I died a whole bunch of times. And check it out, $10,000 times and a half. Wow, that's insane. So if I kept going at this like pace, I don't know. When do you think I'd make a million dollars? Would it be today? Or how about next month? Seriously, to get a million dollars, I'd have to do a million missions, <laughs> probably. Like, oh my god. And that's a bonus this week in Grand Theft Auto. No, 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 no. All right, now let's look at the only other bonus which is gonna be the double cash and the double RP coming out of some of these community jobs that just came in. So there's like, you know, some of these community jobs, like here's one right here, dishing out like double cash and double RP. And there's like some other ones down here, just like some races. I think there's some death matches or something like that too. I know that like one of them requires four people to join, which is absolutely ridiculous to have the requirements of four people to do anything in this game. So here we go, we're just gonna tone it down and we're just gonna do one lap, dishing out double cash and double RP, okay? So we're gonna get a good look at these bonuses that Rockstar has given us this week so we can get a real good idea and judgment whether we're gonna be doing these to make RP and, you know, get some money on the side. You know, the first payout, 10,000. Oh, we'll be talking about that. All right, you guys, so here we go. Double cash, double RP. One lap, completely solo. How much money is this gonna give me? Because normally, I believe with the double cash and double RP on stunt races, if I completed one of those, it'd give me around $25,000. So I'm hoping around 25,000, but to come to my disappointment, we only got a little over 8,000. So that's double cash and double RP right there. If I was to do that normal, I would only get paid like a little over $4,000 right there. Seriously, how is this good for anybody to get anywhere in the game in a short amount of time? Well, that's not going to happen with these bonuses this week because that first one was very disappointing with the times and the half, and it only gave me $10,000 at the end. That mission itself with all the stuff that you have to go through and the time that it took me to get it done because you have to go all the way out to... Uh, humane labs and then like go in there shoot a bunch of people look at a whole bunch of stuff and then from there you got to like go to the little train place and then you know hit the switch and then from there you got to like search all the train stuff and that's like battling a whole bunch of NPCs that keep spawning in along with them helicopters you know good luck with that mess right there without dying especially on hard mode and then at the end just to get ten thousand dollars is absolute trash not to you know let it let you guys know too in my opinion I think those first dose missions are boring there's only only like one good one and I've only played it like three times so the replay rate I think for the first dose um, not that good neither is this DLC in opinion in my mind you there's lots of other ways that you guys can be making way better money than what they're trying to give us this week for like you know oh go do these community races or whatever that are dishing out double cash dude that's only like eight thousand dollars no that's trash dude especially you know when the dax missions or whatever or the first dose dax missions over there only gave me ten thousand i was quite disappointed on that and i could think of probably a thousand if not a million better ways of making money in the game besides from doing that and all the effort and time that is consumed in doing it you know and especially when we have like franklin payphone hit missions that are dishing out like eighty five thousand dollars not to let alone like the security missions over at the agency which are dishing out you know a nice little chunk of change most of the time so anyways from there you guys let me know what your guys' thoughts are down in the comment sections below do you guys think that this is a good week in grand theft auto to be making money off of these bonuses because i don't so anyways there, if you guys enjoyed the video and it was helpful in any way hit that like button on the way out subscribe for more content and thanks for watching my name is gravesite i'll see you in the next one so peace